January of 2013, uh, we produced our first beer. Uh, by March, we were actually Ohio's first canning craft brewery on a two-head uh, filler, uh, doing about 24 cans a minute. And with demand greatly outpacing supply, we decided to, we looked at, at expansion. Um, and here we are now at about a $20 million facility with a, a, a packaging line that can do about 250 cans a minute. We wanted to build a community place where people could come and gather and experience our brand in a much kind of larger, larger facility and larger footprint than they could before. So, um, you know, Regal was uh, uh, definitely instrumental in kind of getting us uh, over this kind of hump from a small brewery to a large brewery pretty fast. Before moving forward with this project, we reached out to several other breweries that worked with the Regal team in the System Plus line of products before making our decision. In general, the startup process was fairly smooth. Um, you know, I've heard horror stories where it's taken some, some breweries six to nine months, even longer, to, uh, to get through the startup process. And if I remember correctly, we were running fairly smoothly within the first month. The Regal team really helped overall by focusing on Mad Tree specific priorities, what our design goals were, what we really needed to accomplish to get this packaging line up and running. I worked as a consultant and integrator on behalf of Madtree to ensure they met their overall goals regarding total cost of ownership and line effectiveness. I specified the proper bundle of parts. This includes System Plast NG Evo modular belts and NOLU S wear strips, seal master bearings, Hera gear boxes and Leeson motors. These are key components that optimize efficiency and result in a 100% dry running conveyor line. This provides both production efficiency and sustainability. One of the benefits of having Jim a part of the overall design and packaging layout was pointing out transition issues that we had throughout the packaging line. One of those transition issues was an end-to-end -end transfer with a piece of equipment. This end-to-end -end transfer would cause down cans or potential downtime of this packaging line. To solve this problem, the Regal team came up with a side transfer module. This side transfer module created smooth transfer from our conveyance line to the piece of equipment. One of the tools the Regal team provided during the installation and startup was a punch list. This punch list helped point out installation issues and things that we didn't really see ourselves. They also provided corrective action for all these issue points. You know, these guys uh, came in and took what to us seems like a very complex piece of machinery and made it very simple. Um, and I know, I know they do projects that are much larger than this, uh, but for us it was very key. Um, they were key in bringing all these components together. I think one of the most important things for us is making sure that we're conducting business in a very sustainable way, uh, friendly to the environment. Um, so the fact that we've got these conveyors that don't need lubrication, uh, that's important for A, we're not putting a lot of this stuff down the drains, uh, and B, it's creating a safer work environment. Guys aren't slipping on soapy floors and stuff like that. The end result is better overall efficiency, higher yield, faster throughput, and generally less maintenance. 